Alright, they broke the ass. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Well, good morning, everyone. I know it's been a while, way longer than I thought, but that's the way life goes. So just a quick little update, then we'll get back to fishing. We have sold our house, we have moved over. There's still a lot of stuff to take care of that you just don't think about and realize, just all the legalities of moving, all the things you have to transfer. So that's still gonna eat up a little bit of my time, but as far as the big house move and selling and closing, all that's done. So now I'm gonna try to get back to focusing on doing some fishing, bring out some more fishing videos. On one of my favorite rivers today, uh, there's a lot of rain coming on the radar. That's been messing me up a lot here lately too. So this is the closest place that I have currently. Just thought I'd shoot over, try to uh, do a little fishing. Depending on how I do this video, I'm probably already going to go ahead and include a couple clips of uh, some fish that I've already caught this morning, but just been waiting on the light to uh, get bright enough to do a quick little intro. So stick with me. I appreciate y'all that's hung around the last couple weeks. I know I haven't been posting. Life's been busy. It's starting to ease up now, so I'm going to get back to pumping these fishing videos out. Thanks for watching. Definitely not no big guy, but a fish nonetheless. What the heck, there's my players. All right. I tell you what, I can always count on this bait. Man, I can always count on this bait. Another little guy. Hey, Swanny Bass, just talking about them. Oh, that old pretty color. Fighting pretty decent. I don't think he's that big though. They just fight so hard in this current. Let's see what we got here. Come on up, buddy. Come on up here. God. He, ain't, he ain't bad, but he sure ain't big either. Little large mouth. All right, 
There we are. Let you go on back. All right, guys, y'all know no trip on this river is complete without me stopping here at some point. Well, maybe you don't know. Maybe you're new to the channel and this right here is blowing your mind, I hope, because this is unique and beautiful. But I can typically catch fish here. As you've already seen, I just caught one over there while I was in the boat. I decided to anchor on this whole beautiful sandbar, do a little wade fishing. There's some side creeks. And typically I'm successful here. No big ones, just a bunch of little ones. I've already seen several. And I am perfectly fine with that. I know some of y'all are thinking, you know, hey, daggum, all this guy catches his little ones. And hey, I do. But I do not specifically try to target big ones. If I want to show y'all some big bass, I'd put on some live bait and make it happen. Oh, getting bit. That is not what this channel has ever been about or will be about. It's about showing y'all this. The fishing is a bonus. Uh oh, getting bit. Oh. Yeah, getting bit by grass. See my line swimming off. But anyways, I may try to specifically target some big bass one day, but I'm not putting that kind of pressure on myself, and I hope y'all understand that. This channel is specifically about outdoor related content, and that'll be hunting here in a few months, as well as fishing. And it's about showing all this off. It's just so pretty around here. So I hope that makes sense. There's plenty of channels on YouTube that target big bass and catch big bass. More power to them, it's tough. I just don't feel like there's many channels on YouTube that show y'all this kind of beautiful places. So that's where I feel like I'm unique. I've tied this old crawfish bait on because whenever I left the ramp this morning in the dark and I shined down there in the water, I was pretty shocked at the uh, amount of crawfish I seen in the size crawfish aren't as common in florida as like say louisiana or something so whenever you're seeing them way bigger than this i was <laughs> i i'm shocked and i'm thinking i'm gonna come make a video and try to trap some because i do like to eat crawfish the ones i've seen this morning were uh, they were eating size very close to it at least uh oh there we go got one come here there he comes look here little guy had to pull him from the other side of the river Little, little guy, but still fun nonetheless. Who wouldn't want to be out here doing this instead of being at work or something? people in their trash. Pick it up, pick it up. This place is way too beautiful for trash. Well, everyone, appreciate y'all for watching. No, I didn't tear them up, and that's the way it goes. Bunch of dinks again, but it felt good to finally get back out here, catch a few fish, make another video. So it's been a long time coming. I appreciate y'all hanging around. You know, uh, like I said, it took much longer than expected. So goes life. To, uh, sell the house get clothes get moved but we're over here now i've got a bunch of new rivers in mind i have uh another video that i'm going to try to go make tomorrow the next day uh that i think everybody's going to want to see so i've been really thinking and planning hard on that one so stay tuned for that uh again appreciate y'all for watching sorry it took so long but i'm back now we'll see if we can start get some of these videos pumped out thank y'all for watching